Download and install Mesh Mixer. You can find it under this link, which is also in the description. You maybe want to opt out of them gathering your usage data during installation. Then open up Mesh Mixer and load your previously exported Lion STL. You can hide the grid and the 3D printer surface under view so that it doesn't get in the way. First, hollow out your model by going to Edit and choose Hollow. Now you can set the thickness of the model. You can either go by eye or you use the needed thickness you found out with the jewelcraft add-on weighing function. Afterwards, just click accept. Now we only need to cut the backside of the object. First, go to edit, create a pivot point Select Snap to Face Center and choose the world frame as a coordinate. Click on the flattened back to set your reference point. Again, go to Edit and choose Plain Cut. Now you can orient the cut on the pivot point by clicking on it, so that the cut will be exactly perpendicular to the lion. Now you can pull on the arrow that faces the lion's front and pull until the shell is gone. And we can see the opening. Now we can export the STL file again. If you want to learn how to create the whole lion's head sculpture from start to finish, click the link in the first comment and get one month free trial. Thanks so much for watching and see you in the next one.